What's going on, guys? Vinny here back with another video. And in this video, guys, we're going to discuss the fact that you only need one setup to become a consistently profitable trader. Uh, for me, personally, when I first started trading, I really didn't know what I was looking at when I was coming to the market each and every day. I was just really looking to hop into a trade. I was listening to too many traders, watching traders on YouTube, uh, looking at trading view uh, ideas. And, you know, everyone has a difference of opinion because you, everyone can come to the chart and some people can see buy, some people can see sales. And it wasn't until I actually learned market structure and the setup that I was looking for each and every time I came to the market that was able to become a consistently profitable trader, you know, cutting out the noise, not listening to any other trader, but really trading for myself and seeing the market, how I see it. And that has helped me tremendously become a consistently profitable trader. So I'm going to show you guys a simple setup uh, that I use and that many of my students use to become consistently profitable. So when I come to the market each and every day, okay, um, for you, you may come to a naked chart like this and some people will come and mark up their charts and, and that's totally fine. Uh, but for me, what I find is that you really have to ask yourself, am I a swing trader? Am I a day trader or am I a scalper? Okay. You really have to know your risk appetite when it comes to the market. Then you can know what you're really looking for. If you're looking to come into the market and get in and out, then you're a scalper. Okay. If you're coming to the market and you're looking to maybe hold a trade for a couple hours, then you're a day trader. But if you're looking for the market and you're looking to hold a trade, maybe for a week, two weeks, sometimes even longer, then you're a swing trader. For me personally, I'm a swing trader because it allows uh, the trade to play out. Okay, so when I come to the market, I'm trading uh, off the four hour time frame. Okay, the four hour and one hour are my bread and butter. Uh, I do look at the daily time frame for my analysis to see what direction price is actually trending in uh, to give me my bias. But for me, when I come to the market each and every day, I'm looking for one thing and one thing only. And thanks to the cheat code indicator, guys, it made it super, super, super simple. So let's go ahead and turn on the cheat code indicator, and I'm going to explain to you how this setup works. So we're going to turn on the indicator here, as you guys can see. And when I come to the market, guys, all I'm simply looking for on the four-hour time frame is a cheat code buy or sell signal, all right? So in this instance right here on GBPAUD, we don't we don't have a cheat code buy or sell signal. Price is what I call in space. Okay, it's not at an extreme uh, to the high point or an extreme to the low point. So I'm not looking to trade this. As a matter of fact, I'm already in a swing trade on GBPAUD for sales. Uh, but personally, if I was coming to the market, I would not trade this because uh, there is no setup for me at this moment. So I will move on to the next pair. But let's just say, for example, uh, this is the first signal that we've seen, the CC sale here on GBP AUD. So let's go ahead and mark it up. So if I see the CC sale, the next thing I'm going to do, guys, is go down to the one hour time frame, which we have on this screen here. And on the one hour time frame, all I'm simply waiting for is a break and a retest of the whole moving average. So we see that we had our signal, we have a divergence. Price broke the whole moving average, made its initial move. Yes, you could have got in on that move, but for me, I'm going to wait for the retest. Patient traders always win. Remember that, patient traders always win. So most of you will try to catch this move right here. That's totally fine, but for me, I'm going to sit back and wait for this, for this uh, retest, which happened here. Price came back. And then this is the real move here, okay? That is the real move that you want to catch. So that break and retest. So our, our setup is very, very simple. It's a four-hour signal, one-hour break and retest. I don't know how many times I have to say it, and it's so simple, but 
that's just how it works, guys. It's a four-hour signal, one-hour break and retest. This actually cuts down on time. I don't have to spend all day on the charts. Actually, when I find a setup and that happens, I can go about my day and do what I need to do, set my stop. My stop will actually be above this previous high here. On the on the, um, I will go to a higher time frame, probably the daily time frame, and see if there is a previous high and set my stop above that high. And then I'm going to set my take profit for uh, these lows here. Okay. And we, went, we eventually got to these lows. I do expect some more down movement on GBPAUD according to the daily time frame. So let's go to the daily so I can show you guys real quick. Okay. All the all it's doing right now is a retest for price to come down lower. Okay. That's what's happening on GBPAUD at this moment. That white candle that you see here is a bullish engulfing candle. This yellow candle is a bearish engulfing candle that you see here. Okay. So um, uh, we see that GBP AUD is pushing up currently to retest these highs, but I do expect some more down movement on GBP AUD. Right. Let's move on to our next pair real quick just to show you guys um, another example. Let's take here uh, AUD USD. I like the way AUD USD moves. So in this example here, guys, if I came to the chart in the morning time uh, and I've seen a CC buy here, okay, all I'm going to simply do is wait for uh, the one hour break and retest. So we can see that happen here. Uh, we got a CC buy. Price finally broke the whole moving average. Came down to retest. Okay, and then price shut up. Okay, and that happened to be the real move. And guys, I'm not going to watch the trade on the lower time frame. I'm actually going to watch the trade on the four hour time frame. OK, I think many of you um, tend to watch your trades on a lower time frame and you get scared out of your positions. OK, so I'm a swing trader. So I know uh, this trade is going to take a while for this trade to play out. OK, so all these little minor movements that come back and forth, back and forth, back and forth. I'm just going to hold on to my trade and wait until it gets to the ultimate target, guys. That's all I'm going to do is wait and be patient, okay? Because patient traders always win. Our strategy is very, very simple, and all you need is one setup, guys, to become a consistently profitable tra a trader. Uh, this is what I look for when I come to the market each and every day. Uh, it may not be a trade every single day, but there is one every single week, multiples throughout the week, okay? And it's simply... Uh, just looking for a CC buy or CC sale in a four hour time frame, and then patiently waiting for a one hour break and retest and trading with the trend on that one hour break and retest. So, um, to get the indicator, guys, there's going to be a link down in the description below. Make sure you click that link, go ahead and purchase the cheat code indicator, guys. Uh, we have all the training videos and everything you need to get started. Uh, to become a consistently profitable trader, okay? Um, this indicator has truly changed my life and is changing many of our members' lives uh, by making trading a lot easier than just trading naked charts, okay? Trading naked charts can be hard. Trying to figure out when to buy and when to sell, that's one of the hardest things about trading is knowing when to buy and when to sell. And when you have something that's going to, accelerate your learning curve and make it easier for you to uh, look for certain things within the market. It's going to make you become a more confident trader and you're going to uh, develop patience and discipline when it comes to the trading game. So again, link in the description below. Make sure you like, comment, subscribe, and I'll see you guys on the inside.